What's up, my dudes? Right now, I'm running out of the wilderness like a wild beast, and I jumped out on this tube across the river. What is up, Torn Fam, and welcome back to a brand new video. Oh, my God. Yeah, as you guys just witnessed, you just watched me go across this creek first try. Well, oh, using this super beautiful, luxurious, inflatable tube. Because I have 173 years worth of tubing experience. So I know what I'm doing. Why you always lying? So since I'm so good at what I do, I have 1.305 billion percent positive. And I can cross the creek in a different way that is way more dangerous. So do you guys see that falling down tree right there? Oh yeah. Well, I'm gonna use my pro skills to climb across that tree to get all the way over to the other side. And I'm also gonna be using this helmet right here to make sure I am safe and protected. Protect. Because this is my most dangerous thought ever and I can literally fall in the water. So please go smash that thumbs up button right now because one like equals one prayer that I won't fall in. But without wasting any more time, let's just go ahead and do this. Let's do this. So I climbed down this hill and went onto the tree, and it was super dangerous, but I just went for it anyways, and I started climbing up it. Whenever all of a sudden something hit me in the back, and it made me jump off the tree, and it fell on me. Oh what the heck? Guys, the tree just broke, and it felt like something hit me. What was that? Torque, it looked like the red gummy bear just hit you when you were trying to climb that tree. Oh, snap. Guys, Rainer so said that a red gummy bear hit me over the tree. Oh, Where did it go? So I started looking everywhere around for the gummy bear, and I even went underwater to try to see if I could find it. Wait, I saw something. I'm going back in. So I reached down and grabbed something. Oh, my God. I got it. Stop. Stupid gummy bear! Guys, the gummy bear knocked me out of my last video! Oh, and then he just knocked me over this tree right here and he made the tree break and fall on top of me! And now my leg is all red and injured from the tree falling on it! Like, look! Oh my god! It's time for me to get payback on this gummy bear because this makes me so mad! Gummy bear, you're gonna get absolutely demolished! So I threw the gummy bear straight into the side of this mountain right here, and then I picked him up, threw him in the creek, and then jumped on him! Then yeeted him into the side of this rock, picked him up, and ran all the way across the creek, and threw him straight up into the sky! But I wasn't done yet, I went over here and grabbed this ginormous 3,000 pound log and rode it all the way into the creek by the gummy bear! Gummy bear, this is what it feels like when a tree falls on you! Oh! Yo, that's a lot of damage! No, that's a lot of damage! Alright, so as you guys can see, the final boss, which was the gummy bear, has finally been defeated! Yes, let's go! But now I'm gonna go inside and celebrate my victory! And eat 7,000 cheese sticks! What? Because cheese sticks are really good! And then we will see you guys on today's main part of the video! Peace out until then! Oh my god! What's up, my dudes? My right now, I'm smashing this like button with this ginormous ass. Whenever all of a sudden I randomly saw something off in the distance, and I pulled out my super high tech binoculars, and I looked through them, and I saw this super giant patch of gray. So I put my binoculars away, and I went and parkoured over the hood of the car, jumped off the and went and grabbed the grave straight off of the tree. And as I was observing the grapes, I all of a sudden had an epic genius idea. So I hurried up and I ran all the way inside so I could grab random stuff so we could film. A few moments later. Yo, for real tour fam, what is up and welcome to today's main part of the video. Yeah, as you guys just saw, I legitimately found these grapes in my backyard. And unfortunately, right before I saw the grapes, I was smashing this like button right here. But if we get really close, as you guys can see, I put a giant hole in the car. Oh and it even busted out the windshield that's behind this. But you guys are probably wondering what my genius epic idea is. And I got right after I found these grapes hanging up on a random tree. And guys, my idea is to set these grapes out in our backyard and put a camera on it to try to see if we can find Knuckles. Like this person up on the screen right here from Sonic the Hedgehog 2 the movie. Because apparently Knuckles really likes grapes. Wow. And also, if you don't remember in this video right here up on the screen, I literally found Sonic and Knuckles in real life! And they literally fought each other! But after we saw them fight, they both disappeared! But since we saw Sonic and Knuckles out here in our backyard, that means they're probably still out here 
somewhere. So I'm gonna go set these grapes up and set a camera on it to see if Knuckles comes and tries to eat them. Just to make sure that he's still here. And hopefully we can capture him on video in real life. But with that way, any more time, let's go ahead and send it, my dude. Just gonna send it. So I started going to where we were gonna be setting the grapes up at. I even took one of the grapes and threw them straight into the pond water to feed the homeless fish. What? Because I'm such a good person. So I started on my journey once again. I did some parkour, but then all of a sudden I saw something. Wait a minute, guys. Look at this wild alligator just sitting there. Oh my god. Oh, hello, man. Guys, we're gonna try to feed it some grapes. I hope it doesn't try eating me. All right, here we go. We're gonna give him this big one right here. Alligator, do you want some food? Huh? Oh, I'll just throw it to the side of him and he can go eat it. <laughs> oh, he's going for it? So the alligator walked over to the grape and picked it up and ate it. Yes, guys, let's go. The alligator just ate one of my grapes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So after I fed the alligator, I started walking once again, but the alligator was staring directly oh, at me. But I wasn't intimidated, and I continued walking. All right, guys, so right around this area approximately is where we saw Sonic fighting Knuckles in real life. Oh so we're going to set all of our grapes for... Oh, my gosh. Oh my God. God. There's only one grape left. No. No. Right here, and then we're gonna set the camera on it like overnight, and hopefully it catches Knuckles on video, and he only like, comes to take this grape because, like I said, he really likes them. But I'm gonna take this thing right here so we can have the grape on it. So I went to put the stick in the ground, but it snapped in half. But I still took part of it and put it in the ground anyways, and set the grapes on top of it. Perfect. Then I jumped up and ran directly towards our pond and did some parkour. Then I grabbed this ginormous inflatable too. So I'm gonna set the camera right here on this inflatable tube, staring directly at the grave. And hopefully Knuckles will see the grave just sitting right there out in the open. He'll run and try to get it. And then whenever he does, we'll capture him on video. So yeah, we're just gonna set the camera down just like this. We'll come back out here later and see if the grave is still here and check on the camera. So peace out until then. So I started running out to my house when all of a sudden the flying Dutchman came out of nowhere and hit me in the back and made me fall. Oh my god. The next day. Oh my gosh, oh guys, my you're not gonna believe this! I just woke up about five minutes ago, even though it's like 5 p.m. And whenever I woke up, I checked my phone and I got a notification from my camera. And I'm gonna put a video up on the screen right here, and this is the video that I saw whenever I clicked on my notification from my camera. And look, any second now, something's gonna run across the screen. Oh, look, it's Knuckles! As you can see, Knuckles literally just ran across the rail on my porch. Oh my! Again, my security camera that's just right up there on our deck. Caught that on video last night while I was sleeping. And also, guys, I'm gonna look through my super high tech binoculars real quick because you guys gotta see this. Whenever I look through them, as you guys can see, all the way on the other side of the pond, the floaty that I set my camera up on is literally flipped over and I don't see the camera. And unfortunately, the grape is gone as well. Dang it! Guys, we gotta go over there and try to see if the camera's there so we can watch the footage and see what happened. Come on! So I ran super epically fast over to my super beautiful, luxurious Ferrari. <laughs> then I started driving all the way over to the other side of our pond where the floaty was located at. Then whenever I arrived, I hopped out of my vehicle, ran all the way over here straight to the floaty, and I threw the floaty up, and right underneath it, there was my camera. Say what? Say what? The camera's Oh the camera was like literally flipped over and the camera was just laying in the grass. Wow. Let's see if we can find what happened on the video. So I looked through all the camera footage and I saw something. Wait, I think I just saw something. Guys, I'm gonna hit play. So I played the video and this is what I saw. Oh my god. Oh my Did you just see that? Guys, I'm gonna rewind and play in slow motion. So I rewinded the video and played it in slow motion. No way. Look, it's literally Knuckles. He grabbed the grapes off of the stick and then he just ran away. And then I'm looking through the camera right now, but I don't see any other videos on it at all. So unfortunately, I don't know how the camera ended up on the ground. Maybe Knuckles like attacked it or something whenever he realized he was being recorded. Wait, guys, we have the camera. Let's just film on this. That's better. But guys, is it absolutely insane? Like we literally set the grave down like right here. And now the grapes and the stick are both gone, which we saw Knuckles in that video. Literally grabbed the grapes as he ran by. Now the stick is gone and I don't know what happened to it. 
Okay, and also the tube that the camera was sitting on that flipped See? over like this. And the camera was just laying right here on the ground. So again, I wonder if Knuckles like attacked it or something. Guys, I don't know. This is absolutely insane. Make sure you go in the comment section down below right now. And let me know what you guys think about this. Like, what do you guys think it is that we should do next? But no way, guys. As you can see, Knuckles is nowhere no. out here. Like, I don't see him anywhere at all. No, God, please, no. But yeah, this video has been absolutely insane. I literally saw Knuckles on my security camera, as you guys just saw. And we also saw him steal our grapes. But I guess there's literally nothing else that we can do today. So, guys, really quick, if you are brand new and you haven't already, please go down below right now and absolutely demolish that subscribe button with your pointy finger. Just do it. Just do it. Do it! And also, guys, Random Stuff just paid me $500 to shout out his YouTube channel. What? So make sure you go to the description down below and click on Random Stuff's YouTube channel and go subscribe to it and watch his latest video because it's super legitness. Legitness. But yeah, my dudes, I should probably go to the hospital because my leg is still hurting from that tree falling on oh. it. So yeah, we will see you guys next time on a brand new video with TORG, aka that one random ginger. Peace out. Yeah.